Hello everyone, it's Bethany. In this unboxing, we have Queen Zara by Andrea Garvey. It is a Diamond Art Club. The dimensions for this piece are 20 inches by 25 inches or 51 centimeters by 64 centimeters. I have been wanting to get this canvas kit for a while because I've been wanting to do it for one of my friends and they haven't had it on stock on the DAC website but I did get a notification that this was in stock at Joann's Fabrics. So I went online to purchase this I was actually able to purchase this for a good deal. I got it for $34.99. Now on the DAC website, it normally sells for $44.99. So that is about $10 off, which is awesome by me. I also got another kit when I ordered this and that is Pink Lotus, which I will be unboxing at some point in the future. I'm not sure when. Let's go ahead and get into this piece. This is what it looks like. It is a round diamond kit. The box is not in perfect shape. It got damaged a little bit in shipping, but I'm pretty sure it's not going to affect the contents. And I am happy to finally have been able to get this kit, so. Because I've been waiting for a while. So, we have the small sticker, small square sticker. Queen Zara by Andrea Garvey, diamond shape brown, size 20 inches by 25 inches. 51 centimeters by 64 centimeters. We have a warranty and instruction card, which is kind of awesome. I guess that's so that you can register that you bought this, even though you didn't actually buy it off of their website and it'll still be covered under warranty. So we have the toolkit, which it looks like it has everything that is in every other toolkit. Let's go ahead and dump everything out and we'll, I'll show them to you as I put everything back. We have the baggies, which are scattered all about. There are not enough for every color in there, but those are useful if when you're finished you want to save some of your leftover diamonds or if you're in the middle of using a packet, say you don't put them in containers and you don't want to risk them spilling out everywhere. Here you have a clear tray, diamond painting pen with a blue grip and a four placer and a single placer of course if you prefer to place one at a time or if you prefer to place four at a time. And two heart-shaped waxes. The canvas comes wrapped in a plastic sleeve, which says Diamond Art Club. Do what makes you sparkle. That is their motto. I'm going to go ahead and roll back this canvas to help it lay flatter while I show it to you guys. Now, if you purchase this and aren't going to start working on it right away, you can just let it lay flat and in, within a few minutes it'll it'll flatten itself out all on its own but because it is poured glue i can roll it back and help it help it along the, along the way so we also have a larger sticker sheet 
which gives you a spot to write the start date and end date of your project, gives you another picture of the picture, gives you the dimensions and information. It also comes with a code, your chart code, which gives you the number, it numbers the colors of diamonds, gives them a symbol, and gives you the corresponding DMC code. These are cut into stickers. If you choose to peel them apart and use them on your containers, We also have step-by-step -step instructions inside. We have our diamond drills. And this is the canvas. Beautiful. On the upper left-hand side, you have the legend. And you have another one on the bottom right hand side. On the bottom, on the very bottom right hand side, you have their lifetime warranty and email support information. At the bottom of the canvas, you have their social media information. In the very bottom left hand corner you have once again the name of the piece Queen Zara the dimensions the artist Andre Garvey and Diamond Art Club you have a thumbnail of the picture and at the top of this canvas do what makes you sparkle Diamond Art Club so this is a poured glue canvas there are two for those of you that don't know there are basically two common types of adhesive used for sticking the diamonds on the canvas one is poured glue and one is double-sided tape poured glue is basically they pour glue on the canvas and you'll be able to recognize that mostly because it comes with a clear cover over the top with double-sided adhesive it will have a paper cover over the top and that's basically just double-sided sticky tape and with double and with double-sided adhesive you do not want to roll your canvas while it is unfinished because it can cause it can cause grooves and bumps in your canvas which will limit the quality of your finished piece so let's look at the drill field this is a really pretty bright colored canvas the drill field looks super clear which is normally the case with diamond art club also with diamond art club canvases you have a extra sparkle on the canvas I don't know if you guys can see that or not. I can see it. Which is very cool, I think. So let's go ahead and look at these diamonds. As I mentioned earlier, these are round diamonds. The quality is really nice, as you can see. Look at those, so pretty. We have 775, two big bags of 3865. And you know, I may end up mixing in some glow-in-the-dark ones with those. I think that might be kind of fun. We'll see, I'll think about it. We have a 334. Two zero nine three five one one twenty six. This is an AV diamond, which stands for Aurora Borealis. It gets its name from the Northern Lights. It is covered with an iridescent coating, which gives it an extra special sparkle. That is one twenty six. It's a light purple color, very pretty lavender. Three fifty two seven zero one. 
Oh my goodness, that's the other AB in this kit. How pretty. So this is the other AB in this kit. It is a dark blue. See how that coating on there shines extra? It's extra. <laughs> All right, we have 782, 814, 718, 355, 550, 743, and 3846. That's a pretty color. They're all pretty colors. The colors in this kit are really bright. I like it. All right. We have 963, 3755, 3755 819 we have two of those and a little green hitchhiker what's he doing in there 322 312 3608 3609 3841 703 3607 704, 3855, 350, 601, 150, 900, 702, and 210. Now let's go ahead and see if we can locate where those ADs are. So. We are looking for symbols one and two. Symbol number one is going to be the lavender AB, and symbol number two is going to be that dark blue AB. So let's see. Here's some ones over here in this flower here. Very pretty. There's some ones down here, just in the background. Here's some twos. There's some twos down, down here and up here and kind of outlining this flower right here. And now that I look, there are some on the outlines. Number two has quite a few outlines. Oh, there's also some two in the eyes at the top, kind of like an eyeshadow. That's going to be really pretty. There's some ones up here. I, I do see some twos over here in this part of the flower crown. So there's also outlines of the dark blue here and here and over here. There are some ones here in the trunk. Hold this canvas a little closer to my eyes so I can see. Oh, there's some twos, twos right there. Are there any more that I haven't noticed or pointed out yet? Huh. That's all that I see so far. But um, I do have a good variety of rainbow colored extra AB drill. So I'll probably be scattering them all throughout this canvas when I do this. There may be some more AB drill areas that I haven't noticed while briefly looking over this with you guys right now. But for now, that's what I see. I am going to read for you the description of this piece from the Diamond Art Club website. And it says, crowned with purple lotus petals, the elephant is believed to be a symbol of divinity and royalty in Indian culture. 
inspirational cotton candy pinks, frosty blues, and lemon chiffon yellows effuse the scene with floral splendor. With one look into her deep emerald eyes, you'll lose yourself in her calm intelligence and emotional depth. I'm going to go get started on this because I am super eager to go. So thanks for watching guys. I will talk to you next time. Bye.